I wonder if it won't change its mind once I defeat you. But then for some reason, Donald and Goofy just vanish, and it's a one-on-one -on -one fight against Sephiroth. And he opens up the fight with Octo Slash, and so you need to press Triangle to use a reaction command in order to defend against Octo Slash. Otherwise, it's really gonna fuck you up. Uh, from that point on, we'll mostly swap, uh, follow up with like a bunch of swings Did and I stuff. Did something wrong at some point that like this is what's happening now? What? what are you, wait, what are you talking about? Like, where did I go wrong? Uh... Here we go. Here we go. What? Where did- when did I'm, this become my fate? Here we go. I'm, I'm, I'm confused, Ellie. What are you talking about? I'll We're talking about Kingdom Hearts. We are? Yeah, so, it, one of the cool things about Kingdom Hearts 2 is that it's got a whole bunch of different Keyblades. And they all have, like, different, like, abilities attached to them, and so there's a lot of different styles of play. That you can that you can do and like in some cases like people like one of the best keyblades in the entire game is actually the Halloween Town keyblade believe it or not. Believe it. What year is it? Uh, twenty twenty three. Oh. Already, yeah. huh? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> guess it really is. Guess 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 so. I hope you're not Ooh. lying to me. I am lying, I'm sorry, it's 2022. There's, There's a black, black frog in here! That's what I'm so fucking I don't know what a frog is! It's almost November. We could be playing Super Mario Sunshine right now. <laughs> we could be, that's not one of our up. I mean, I guess there's that stop on us from playing Sunshine someday. It's just like, that's what I would have told myself right now as like a kid. As a kid, oh, my, yeah. my GameCube was at my grandparents' house, because they lived yeah. in town, we went to see them a lot, and they were like, so I had my GameCube there. I play a lot of games at their house, and the two of the ones I played most often were this and Mario Sunshine. Super Mario Sunshine? And very often, I'd be playing this game, and then I'd be like, I'd rather be playing Super Mario. Yeah, Super Mario Sunshine is a great game. Mm -hmm. One of the best so, 3D Mario's. So, I'd say like Super Mario Sunshine is one of my favorite games ever made. Uh, it's, it's, and I it's think this, weird because like, I think this game is like irredeemably bad. It, it, it's kind of it's kind of crazy because it's like, 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 what, like 3D Mario is such a high bar for all of them. Uh, yeah, and they just keep it up. Crazy. And just keep it up. Odyssey is one of my favorite games on the Switch. What was your favorite part of Odyssey? Um, I liked the capture mechanic. I thought the capture mechanic was good. I liked the the movement too. I liked how you could jump off a wall and then throw your hat and then jump onto the hat and then do a bounce it's, off the hat. The, and then the, do a it, dive. Has, it does have, I think, easily the best move set for a easily. Scenario. Easily. Like it's funny because the other games kind of trade back and forth on that. It's like pretty even between a lot of them. There's some that are weaker, some that are stronger. Yeah. Odyssey just like, kind of puts it all to shame. I would say that something like Galaxy has really strong level design, but not that strong movement, because it's pretty limited in what you can do. Yeah. But its level design makes up for it, whereas something with, like, Sunshine has such a strange and fun uh, um, way of moving. Yeah. You know, with the Flood. You like yeah, Flood? Like... Is that one of your favorite characters? I like Flood. Mario! I am Flood. We need to clear your name and clean up Isle Delfino. I cried during that cutscene. That cutscene was so emotional. Em emotional? Emotional. Emotional. Dun 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 dun. Mario. Mario. Man, I remember when I first played that game and it took me forever to beat it. It took me so many years to beat it. Because it's hard. It's hard. I didn't I didn't know what to do. People overfixate on the jank in that game, in my opinion. Yeah. Like it's it's janky in spots for sure. But it's so cool. But it's like it's mostly pretty polished, I don't know. Yeah. I think it's one of the games where I think people are a little too like focused on the couple of levels that are like really bad. Yeah. Like yeah, it's definitely sure. got rough patches, it's definitely like it's a little unfinished in spots, but like could be worse. There's other games that I could probably compare it to that are a lot worse. Oh, for sure. You know, games out there, like GameCube games that are unforgivably bad and unfinished. 
Yeah, one of my least favorite ones I remember playing as a kid was the Scorpion King on GameCube. Mm -hmm. That one's really bad. Yeah, that's the one I was thinking of. You ever play Scorpion King on Nintendo GumCube? I think I'm gonna bludgeon myself in this skull with this coffee mug. Wait, what's going on? How come? <laughs> Let me see, Scorpion King, who made that? Scorpion King... GameCube. Oh, we're going to Mystic Manor, cool. Yeah, we, we did, we beat the other one, we just beat the last one. Oh, cool. We're allowed to yeah, talk I about it, it now. <laughs> the game serves as a prequel to the film The Scorpion King, and Dwayne Johnson provided a voice. Dwayne, wow. huh? Dwayne, huh? <laughs> what a guy. Okay, we're fighting we're what fighting a castle! Why is there, like, a button? You see the button back there? Yeah. Did they, like... I'm wondering if, like, the level designers made this level... By just being like, we don't have a door that opens and closes that isn't connected to a stupid fucking switch. Yeah. So we're just gonna have, have to a run one... past a stupid fucking switch. At like the very start. Yeah. That's so funny. It's pretty funny. Oh. oh. The programmers are busy. Like we we can't give you an automatic door. Just put a switch back there. No one will put a switch back there. No one notice it. They won't notice it. We'll just run into have him run through it during the intro. And they're like, all right. Man, I'm excited to see the thumbnails for this these episode. <laughs> Wow, you're, that's the, I'm the one that's making them, so I hope that that's, uh, you're putting me under a lot of pressure right now. I just mean that, like, what the fuck are you gonna do? <laughs> I I don't know, Al. I'm not sure, to be honest. I've At one point, I'd say this series was, like, the height of our thumbnails. I thought I was doing a really good job. You were- I still think it's the height. But now it's like, what do you- what do I do? Uh, you put just a picture of a key getting bigger <laughs> every episode. No, I've already done this. The shadow arc was, was very avant-garde. Yeah. And I don't, <laughs> I don't, people didn't really latch on to it in the way one would have hoped. Yeah. I didn't get the reaction I wanted from the, the gag at the end. I don't think they really got it, so. No, they don't It was too, too high concept. So I don't it's do that. Too... I don't do that anymore. No more Yamcha holes, no more falling shadows. That's not- that's the old Ellie. You're a bitch and I hate you. Are you just gonna use the same, um, border for training memories that you did for Kingdom Hearts 1? I'm actually not sure yet. I was thinking about doing, like, a gold border or something, like, just changing the color. Yeah. Like I would recommend if you wanna- I would recommend, like, a minor change would be to change the- the heart sign that you had into, like, a- one of the- the symbol of the playing cards. Oh, yeah. I think that would be a really easy way to just distinguish it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm excited to look at the little the little fellas in that game. Yeah, Sora. There's Donald. a lot of interesting characters to look at. We we get to meet so many more. There's a dog. Pluto. Yes, and there's the other dog. Donald, Donald Duck. Yeah. We're equivalently Mickey. funny. Yeah, this is true. Hey, look at that! You found it. What a strange place to hide a key. Strange place for I'm just like, I'm a little in tune with this game's horrible, weird idiosyncrasies now. Yeah. Whoa, it is a ghost! It is a, a ghost! ghost. G -g ghost! Rank the. Can we do a tier list, like an impromptu tier list of the Scooby Doo characters? Yeah, number. number and the game pending five. tier list, game pending tier list, okay? Okay, number five. What's the uh, Daphne? But what's the what's Daphne's the rank? Course. That's not what's the rank. Oh. Uh, it's a tier no list. Good. No, no good. good. No good is Daphne. What's wrong with Daphne? Yeah. Daphne's just boring. The best Daphne ever gets is in um. You already have a key. Right. I, oh, we sorry, I need forgot to the this, epic though. puzzle. Um. The best Daphne gets, I think, is in the live action Scooby Doo movie where they have her be like. Like, in the interim between when they broken up and stuff, she, like, learned, like, fucking karate or some shit. Mm -hmm. And became super powerful. But, like, Daphne's just kind of boring. Yeah, I agree. Uh, and then what's at, what's above no good? Um... Uh... It's fine, I think. It's fine. Oh, and no? it's cool. Oh, oh, no, yeah. Maybe Daphne's oh, no, actually. Yeah. Because she's, she's not terrible. She's just not very, like... Can we... Um, if we put Scrappy Doo on it, he would be twisted. Scrappy right? Good is twisted. Yeah, Scrappy, Scrappy Doo sucks. is twisted. And no one likes Scrappy Doo. If you're out there, if you're about to comment saying Scrappy Doo is your favorite character, you're wrong. You don't think that. Yeah, like yeah, 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 yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, you don't actually think that. Um, uh, above Daphne, I would say, or I'd say probably the same tier as Daphne is Fred. I like Fred. Fred's alright. Can, we put, little can we put Fred in, in It's Fine? Yeah. I think Fred is fine. I think Fred's fine. I like I his think... I like his schemes, I like his little ascot. Yeah, his ascot's pretty good. I just feel like he's sort of an everyman, but he's sort of like a, like a bit of, when, like I, he's a bit of a himbo, I think sometimes. I like it when they lean I like it in the modern stuff where they lean more into him just being a complete dumbass. Yeah. Like that's... a charismatic dumbass. I like I like Fred alright. He's okay. Uh, above that is Velma. Velma, I think Velma is cool. Velma's cool. I like Velma. Whoa. Um, um Velma's yeah. Velma's fine. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, she's like, you know, she's probably the funniest of like the regular humans. Yeah. Um. Uh, and then I think like like the hardest the hard one I think is deciding who's better, Scooby or Shaggy. I think that. I don't know. I think Scooby might just be cool because I think he can be a little annoying. Scooby can be a little annoying, but it, I feel like he's often better than Shaggy. The difference is that the highs of Shaggy are really high. Yeah, Shaggy's a great meme character. Yeah, he is. He is. That's another thing, is that Shaggy was really, like, enhanced by the the presence of the internet. Hey, so, like, why... There's, like, yeah, a... Yeah, I don't know what happened there. There's, like, a current going against me. Oh, is there? Yeah, it's, like... Oh, you see... So I'm holding to... left on the controller right now. This game's um, awesome. Anyway, we gotta finish it. We gotta finish it. Uh, I want to say that Shaggy is at... I think Scooby and Shaggy are both awesome. Yeah, I think they're awesome. I'd and say I... you can't have a Scooby-Doo without Scooby and Shaggy. Yeah. Like, you can have Scooby-Doo without any of the other characters, but you need Scooby and Shaggy. You need Scooby and Shaggy. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Anyway, that, so that, that's our tier list of the... Oh, and the the Mystery Machine is uh, cool, too. Yeah. I like the Mystery better Machine. Than, better than Daphne. Better than Daphne. Almost, almost better than Fred. Yeah. Oh, well, this is nice. Guys, comment if I put a, like, visuals in for that. I was thinking about putting visuals in for that. <laughs> Let us know. Let us know if I, I thought that was worth the time. Or if, or if she gave up and you just watched that fucking tragedy instead. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I'm gonna go insane. It's only been an hour. Like, we're actually, like, we're not making time. Because I said, like, if we get one every half hour, it's like we're going to make good time. We did not get one in the last 40 minutes. Ah! Ah! Don't be anyone but Team Rose for this level. Don't pick Sonic. I'm trying to back, but it won't let me back. Wait, you can't press B? There you go. I hate how much I hope much I'll get some fucking car. I hope how much I'll get scrapped. Did we get this one? What? No. We were gonna get Lost it. Lost jungle. We didn't get it. No. I, 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 you were being... <laughs> Did you forget? I'm really, you like went to the I'm, next. It's, it's actually really hot in the apartment right now. I'm really sweaty. <laughs> You, you forgot that we didn't get I'm one. I'm having like I'm actually like disassociating right now. Like my <laughs> eyes are like like rolling back in my head. <laughs> like I, I can't how... see straight. I'm my vision's blurry. Remember how people told us that it would be fine if we cheated and just got them? No, that's stupid. Yeah. That's dumb. If you said that, you're dumb. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. Go back to watching Markiplier, bozo. <laughs> no, he'd be nice. Sorry, I don't remember even who said that. I don't remember. Jared, can you turn the heat down? It's really well, hot and I'm having a mental breakdown. <laughs> You're just walking back and forth. Like, don't laugh at me, don't be mean. I'm not being mean. I'm just pointing it out. Jared, it's it's horrible. We've yeah. only gotten one more Chaos Emerald since this started. What did I tell you? Yeah, I know what you told me. I told Jared. Jared cursed me. Jared jinxed me because I said ahead What'd of time. What he say? I said like, I think we might finish the game today, and he's like, "Oh, are you like, are you at the end?" And I'm like, "Yeah, we just need to get the rest of the chaos emeralds, and then, <laughs> like, and then that's it." And he said, yeah. "Well, you're probably not gonna do it then." He's like, "Okay, I don't know why you think you're gonna finish it." And I'm like, "Well, wow, wow. it's nothing." <laughs> yeah, just five emeralds. What, what did you What did you say? What did you say? Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. 
Just uh, do your Sonic your Rose. Get your get your payoff anyways. I'm gonna have a few quarters with you. I, and I, I do, but I can't really have one while I'm recording. It's it's very sticky. This is my favorite part, is when this happens and you just bounce for a little bit. I <laughs> love it, die. it's great. I'm sorry, if guys, if I imply that Jared said that thing in a mean way, he said it in like a normal way. He <laughs> it didn't say, he didn't he say it mean like. Whoa. But I interpreted it mean like because this game brings me a lot of angst and pain. Hey, why... Be still? Be still. Be still? You're- you, Why, why like, are you not grabbing it? Is it real with danger? Alright, you have so many lives. It's like, whatever. I don't care. The lives do not matter, even a little. Like, I don't die most of the time on these. Yeah. What matters is just the having to play the level over and over again. Yeah, I, I know, right? Like, that's the worst part about this. With, just let us unlock the special stage and then play it from the menu. Yeah. No. Like it's so, it's such more, a simple, it's, like, Isn't change. that more fun this way? No, it's not. Wait. Hey, I'll do you choose. guys want to, like, you guys want to play the game levels over and over again and then do, like, a completely unrelated challenge that is, like, extremely buggy? Yeah. And then have that decide whether you, like, and then need to do the whole level again? Like, it's just, it's like... Yeah. It's it's nothing. It's there's a, it's completely disconnected. What was this, the this chaotic are... version of this level? A uh, frog just. No, no, it was fine. Ten Chow. It's not horrible. The first part was. was I'm just thinking if we can do, chaotics for this one as well. Let's say Ellie, if you fail this one, let's go play Bingo Highway as chaotics. Okay. I know, Cream. There's some bad robots. I know. I know, Kareem. We know about the bad robots. Again. I am. Yeah. It's like I'm playing That's... the level in the exact same sequence every time now. It's just the same. Like, it's down to, like, a science. Like, I'm a speed Yeah. Runner. Ho ho! The, uh, the way that he wields that hammer around reminds me of Dark Souls. <laughs> What's the level we did beat? Was it the Rail Canyon one? Yeah, we beat that one for shot. That was- that got me a lot of confidence. Yeah. For, like, a sec. Yeah. It did. I was like, when you did that one, I was like, oh, this isn't going to be too bad. Like, Same. that third one seems hard, but maybe the rest will be fine. I think my teeth are falling out. <laughs> <laughs> Guys. Dad, <what's> <laughs> Ellie, pick up your teeth. Everybody. Ellie, here, I'm going to let you do the I need to go use the restroom. Okay? Yeah. Are you going to be okay doing this by yourself? Yeah. Okay. Good luck. I'll be back. Guys. Hey guys. I mean, I feel like I'm losing all sense of like personhood that I had once. Like I'm not, I don't think I'm dumb human anymore. This game has robbed me of my humanity. It's like Dark Souls. I'm going hollow. We've done that bit already. Is it good when we recycle bits? Like, do you guys like it or not when we do the same bit over and over again? Because I think we like it because it's easy for us, but I, it's probably not that funny. I don't know if the show's funny or not. What? The camera? Okay, that's fine. It would be like it would make Al happy if we were able to do it. So let's just do it. Like, wouldn't that be nice if Al came back and was like, "Wow, you did it." I think even if I don't do it, I'll lie to Al and tell him I did it. Okay. That's cruel. That would be a cruel lie, actually. Because like, what if we do the rest of them and then I'm like, "Yeah, we need to go back and do that one that I said I did," because that was just me telling a lie. That might cause Al to lose his humanity. And I don't like that. Al's my co-host. So I'm not gonna miss any mean pranks. We're definitely not gonna get it. Motherfucker!